हेलो माय नेम इज़ डॉक्टर जगदीश शिंदे एंड आई एम वर्किंग एज अ कैंसर स्पेशलिस्ट एंड रेडिएशन ऑन्कोलॉजिस्ट इन पुणे इंडिया एंड इन टुडेज वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू रिगार्डिंग स्टीरियोटेक्टिक रेडियो सर्जरी दैट इज एस आर एस एंड स्टीरियोटेक्टिक रेडियोथेरपी दैट इज एस आर टी सो दीज आर द वेरी एडवांस फॉर्म ऑफ रेडिएशन थेरपीज डन इन ट्रीटमेंट ऑफ कैंसर जनरली वेन वी गिव रेडिएशन फॉर इन इन कन्वेंशनल सेटअप देन वी ट्रीट पेशेंट्स फॉर अराउंड फाइव टू सेवन वीक्स एंड वी गिव वेरी स्मॉल डोज ऑफ रेडिएशन डेली ओवर द लॉन्ग पीरियड ऑफ टाइम बट इन केस ऑफ स्टीरोटेक्टिक रेडियो सर्जरी एंड स्टीरोटेक्टिक रेडियोथेरपी वी गिव वेरी लार्ज डोज ऑफ रेडिएशन इन वेरी शॉर्ट पीरियड ऑफ टाइम इन केस ऑफ स्टीरोटेक्टिक रेडियो सर्जरी वी गिव वेरी लार्ज डोज ऑफ रेडिएशन इन अ इंट्राक्राइनल ट्यूमर इन अ सिंगल डे मीन्स इन ओनली वन सेटअप वी गिव होल डोज ऑफ रेडिएशन दैट इज कॉल्ड एज स्टीरोटेक्टिक रेडियो सर्जरी इवन दो दिस वर्ड कंटेंस कंटेंस सर्जरी is not related to surgery so this is a radi- kind of a radiation so this is a kind of a misnomer so there is no surgery done in this case the radiation is done but the process is called as radio surgery because the whole process is completed in one day that's why it is called as a radio surgery in case of stereotactic radiotherapy the planning is same but we give uh, the dose of radiation in uh, number of fractions Uh, generally it is given in 2 uh, to 10 fractions depending on the site of the disease so in stereotactic radio surgery the treatment will be completed within one day and in stereotactic radiotherapy treatment will be completed in 2 to 10 days depending on the number of fractions used so that is the basic uh, when this uh, stereotactic radio surgery or srs or srt treatment is done in cancer so this step of treatments are used uh, in case of uh, tumors of brain so most common indication for uh, this treatment is brain metastasis or when uh, there is some cancer which is developed in the body and it has spread to the brain and uh, there is no extensive metastasis means if the number of tumors are less than 5 uh, or less than 3 uh, then this kind of treatment can be done if the number of metastases in the brain are more than 5 then generally we prefer to give radiation to the whole brain instead of giving radiation to the only tumors so the difference between whole brain radiation and uh, stereotactic radio surgery is uh, we in stereotactic radio surgery we give radiation only to the tumors and in whole brain radiation we give radiation to complete brain so that is the difference between srs and whole brain radiation <clears throat> so uh, if the number of radi- uh, metastases in the brain uh, or the tumors in the brain is less uh, generally we give up to 3 to 5 uh, maximum 5 re- tumors are there then we can go ahead with the srs uh, treatment or srt treatment uh, the second indication is uh, there are some uh, benign conditions like acoustic neuroma or uh, there are some vascular conditions like uh, av malform- malformations in the brain in that cases also we can treat the patient with stereotactic radio surgery or radiotherapy uh, there are some other conditions like meningioma in that cases also we can treat with the uh, stereotactic treatment so these are the different conditions in which we can uh, treat the patient with srs or srt the next thing is that how what is the process of treatment so when we plan for a uh, any patient for srs or srt the first thing is simulation so in case of uh, srs treatment we need uh, two kind of images one is mr imaging that is mri and second is ct scan so the ct scan is done with, along with immobilization devices like orbit mask uh, in previous days uh, there were invasive masks were used but nowadays the many invasive masks are absolute and they are not uh, used due to uh, development of the newer technology and imaging modalities like cone beam ct scan and we use non invasive uh, masks nowadays and after making mask we do a planning ct scan of the patient along with these masks and once this uh, planning ct scan is done that planning scan 
will be imported to our software planning software and in planning software what we do is we do a fusion of mri scan and ct scan uh, in a software uh, because uh, what happens is that we cannot see uh, uh, brain tumors uh, very clearly in the ct scan and we can see brain tumors more clearly in the mri scan so we do tumor marking in the mri scan and we uh, interpolate that tumor in the ct scan and the radiography planning will be done in a ct scan so that's how the planning will be done and once planning is ready uh, the next step is the uh, qa or quality assurance so we do quality assurance of the plan whether the plan is uh, plan which we have make, made uh, is uh, delivering uh, the proper dose or not so we uh, do it a dummy run and then once it passes the quality assurance then the next step is treatment so in treatment the patient will be taken to the to the machine and uh, the plan is implemented and it takes around uh, uh, 10 to 20 minutes depending on the energy of the machine and uh, uh, what is the site and how many uh, how how much dose is given so it takes around 10 to 20 minutes for treatment uh, with modern machines uh, and use of triple f technology uh, the treatment is completed very fast in previous days it took very large, uh, long time for treatment with uh, srs so this is how treatment will be given uh, then uh, there are different uh, machines or uh, different techniques of uh, stereotactic radiotherapy or stereotactic radio surgery uh, the most commonly used uh, is the linac based stereotactic radiotherapy so the linear accelerator machine is well capable of giving a stereotactic radio surgery so you need to consult your radiation oncologist to know whether uh, we can do linear based radio surgery then there are the, some uh, other techniques like uh, uh, cyber knife uh, then uh, gamma knife these are some other uh, techniques which can be done uh, for uh, uh, stereotactic radio surgery so uh, now nowadays gamma knife is not used uh, in many places because uh, uh, this was uh, used previously but nowadays uh, most of the centers they are having linac based radio surgery uh, units so uh, if there is no gamma knife because many times uh, other doctors feel that radio surgery means only gamma knife but it is not like that radio surgery can be done in a linear, linear accelerator machine also and uh, uh, so even though there is no gamma knife or uh, uh, cyber knife in your uh, city there is no problem the radiation uh, SRS can be done in uh, uh, linac also if you uh, have any doubt regarding uh, stereotactic radio surgery uh, we have very good setup uh, india is one of the best uh, radio surgery units uh, in our hospital and if you want to do radio surgery for your patient then you can consult me uh, then uh, if you want any opinion about uh, treatment of uh, radiotherapy treatment or any cancer treatment then you can do paid online consultation with me i will give link for paid online consultation in the description uh, please do consider about subscribing to my channel and uh, to like and comment on the channel thank you